What's up guys, Avery here bringing you a Black Ops 3 Derizen Drag tutorial. This is actually going to be for step 3 of the Fire or Magma bow. I'm going to make it kind of easy for you guys because a lot of people don't really like doing the difficult bows. So, this is going to sum it up for you and make it 10 times easier for the people that have difficulty. Now there's three symbols for this once you turn up gear in the clock tower or bell tower. So the first one we're going to start off with is the cross. Now the cross symbol is located in the Samantha and Eddie's room fireplace. Now it seems pretty hard and it kind of is, but it's pretty easy once you got, kind of find, follow this tutorial. So the flaming ring that will be activated where you have to get to shoot the Ragnarok from is going to be located by the double tap walkway. Now you want to shoot the Ragnarok a little bit before the bridge and a little bit after the trap. I kind of screwed up and I ended up shooting the steps after for the second shot, but it still worked and all you want to, have to, want to do after that is shoot through the doorway or the window of Samantha and Eddie's room. Once you do that, the Ragnarok will be parallel to the fireplace and just shoot right in the center of the fireplace while staying in the Ragnarok and that is complete. Now for the second one, if you have the double arrow sandwich, you can see what I'm saying by from the video, I really don't know how to explain the symbols. But it's located by the Wonder Fizz near the Dragon. Um, it's kind of on the right side if you're looking at the map. And it's kind of difficult, not as much as the one before. And all you want to do is go to the bell tower where that is the flaming ring that goes along with this fireplace. Now, looking between the tall metal sphere and the tower, there's going to be a little, I guess, square rock, the way this uh, castle is structured, and you're going to want to shoot your arrow right there. Then, if done correctly and you hit that rock all the way on the other side of the death ray area, you're going to walk into it, and then you'll notice that there is an opening due to the structure, and you just want to shoot that arrow straight into the doorway of this area of the fireplace. Now, once you do that, all you have to do is walk up into the Ragnarok, and then you just shoot the arrow uh, or the Ragnarok into the fireplace, and you have it. Sham wow. So, the third one, or whatever one order you do it in, is the arrow. It's a solid arrow, and then a double arrow on a stick. And this fireplace is located by the science lab. It's actually the easiest one to do. And it's the fire ring is located by the death ray. And everyone knows where this is. And it's also where you finish up this step. So you want to shoot the colored glass to the science lab if you're looking at it. And the Ragnarok will actually drop. That's one of the mechanics. You can shoot it at a wall and it'll drop in that location. So it ends up in front of the steps of the science lab. Now all you want to do is stand in the Ragnarok, shoot to the left or the right of the control panels of the science lab. Then it will either be wherever you shot, you'll have a perfect line of fire to the fireplace. Now that is it for all three of these as a tutorial. I tried to do it very quickly and kind of detailed as possible. Now this is the easiest way, I mean most people know this already, but it's just something for the people that don't know or that don't want to do this bow. It's sort of a little extra for dummies guide, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm Avery, if you did get something out of this, drop a like or subscribe or dislike it, either one, but I'm out.